<laughs> Greetings, fellow Bolton Masters. It is I, how dare you? How dare you interrupt my intro? As I was saying, greetings, fellow Bolton Masters. It is I, Sky Osteen, and I welcome you to another video. Today we are continuing our SSA walkthrough series, uh, to which we are on Chapter 16, huh? the uh, Creepy Citadel. So without further ado, let's continue. This is Creepy Citadel, right? Pretty sure it is. Might be wrong. So, I like normal where you turn that and just go straight forward. If you go to the right from the start, you will go in here and find Hex's soldier. First bit of treasure for the level. And uh, we'll watch the preview. that in the preview they only show Hex on huh? her uh, skull path, not on her last path. Although I would ag I would uh, agree eh, nowadays that that is her better path. Uh, after having played, like really played with her on that path, I really like it. I consider it preferable to the orb path. Not that the orb path is bad. Not that the orb path is bad. Right? If you go to the left from there, using the cannon to break down the wall, uh, we're going here and find the story scroll. And, uh, we'll listen to that. The philosopher King Mortalanus, first lord of the undead, said, "While the living fear the undead, the opposite is not true. The undead are reasonable." They simply wish the living to stop, well, living. Where is the confusion? We will all be on the same team, eventually. I actually really like that story scroll. Um, it, it's one that uh, I remember. Like, uh, I'll legitimately remember that one. Oh, also, uh, I don't think it appears anywhere else in any of the levels, but there's a Spyro uh, skeleton right here. I like to consider this the skeleton of the first Spyro huh? from the Spyro games. That or this just shows that um, Spyro's species is uh, dead dead. Yes, 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 skull. defeat an undead enemy. I mean, the rotting Robbies make sense because you burn their bodies. But what about the, uh, our bony boys there? Are we completely just powderizing their bones? I don't know. Questions remain unanswered. up with these push block puzzles. I bet they reverse engineer them. Like they they start with the solution and then they backtrack to find out how they need to be solved. That make the most sense, I think. Oh it's crazy. Chop Chop can defeat that. There we go, that would be a mighty challenge for some of these undead levels. Go through without killing a single undead spell. So, there's just constant rhubarbs. And you have to kill a rhubarb, and you have to kill a rhubarb in the same room as it. At least one for every time a rhubarb shows up. Alrighty, so. Let's uh, open up this chest here. Out with 
with the rhubarb, some babies, all that stuff. But yeah, and that was a treasure chest. I don't know if I called that out or not. I was confused. Why didn't the gate go down? So right here is Trigger Happy Soul Gem, which I think is the last. Yeah, that's the last of the uh, starter pack Skylander Soul Gem. So we can watch this preview. And uh, here's our dragon treasure for the level. Now there's multiple places for the dragon treasure to show up in each level, but whatever. So, uh, push this down. Rod and Robbie's to show up, but we can just push this. Down. So they really aren't that big of a threat. Oh, rotting Robbies! Come hither, come hither! Odd that they light on fire after being, uh, after having a cannon pushed into them. Ready? You so, need uh, a tech skyline uh, to unlock this gate. Push that first. Alrighty, let's go into this tech gate here. Yep, open that up. If I'm not mistaken, the uh, gates my soul. or gates in this level are like uh they're kind of like little heroic challenges, where it's like, Skylanders you collect the this. Are stronger in this zone. Yeah, collect ten enchanted skulls and then you have a timer. Pro tip, I'm pretty sure these enemies respawn every time we go in here. So this is a great place to rack up your uh, enemy goal in case you didn't already get it. Technically, uh, kind of infinite enemies. I'm sure I actually already got the enemy goal on this level in the playthrough, so... Also, this is a really easy... The really simple challenge. Oh, there actually was a... No! There was a chest in there. There was a chest in there. I happened to notice that there was a chest in there. We'll be back for that. Skylanders of the fire element are stronger in this zone. There, there may or may not have been a chest in there. I'll have to go back. I forgot about it. There wasn't one in there, and I have to go back for it. I won't make you guys sit through the first part of the pivot level. Editing magic. Which is Earth? The Earth? Going onwards. 
elements. Skylanders of the Earth element are stronger in this zone. Escape the maze. Can we just use the maze trick on this over here? The, the maze trick is a very simple uh, algorithm idea for mazes. It simply goes if you follow one side of a wall for long enough, you'll find the end of a maze. Seeing as uh, mazes are just one line stretched out along the way. So we'll see if the maze trick applies here. Oh, well, would you look at that? The maze trick applies. I really hope there's nothing hidden in there. Because that would suck. Knowing Skylanders is probably something hidden in there. Skylanders <laughs> of the undead element are stronger in but this zone. But one can hope. this up over yonder. We'll take care of the uh, uh, spider sacks. Show up. I forget what they're actually called. They aren't called spider sacks, I don't think. Spider spitters, maybe? Because you have a liberation. Skylanders games love alliteration in them, you know. Makes you wonder, where's Charles the Chompy? <laughs> we need Charles the Chompy. Huh? Hi! Here's our legendary treasure. That's how you get that. So with this cannon, we're gonna blow away a couple paths. The first of which is that it's uh, already set the direction, which only gives you just that money right there. There's nothing actually in there, so optional. You push it along this way so that it's facing in the opposite direction of that of to which it had started. Push back, blow away this wall, and get this chest. Then you push this back up and in the direction that you needed it for uh, actually getting through this. And uh, yeah, then you're all good. Shoot the Kyanya. Oh no. Rotting Robbies. Whatever will I do? If only there was a way to take care of them. Moria? No? Good. Sweet. Okay. Okay. 
So, business forwards, as per usual. But there's nothing special to do. I. No, yeah, no, there's nothing special to do. Saying there, I thought that was a uh, barrier that you could break down. That was just a. Uh, Okay, let's line up now. Line up, good, good. Now that you're all lined up. No, he's still. Oh. There we go, huh? Immaculate. And I'm almost entirely certain that I, uh, left behind a treasure chest and that's behind my keys. That would be a mighty challenge for these undead levels. You can't kill the undead spell punk until you've killed a rhubarb huh? that it summons. That's the challenge. So feel free to apply that uh, to yourself if you want to test your skill. Rhubarbs really aren't that hard of enemies to kill. They're just strong and they have a lot of health. But they aren't actually hard to fight. They're just annoying. Tedious is the The end of the level. It is nigh. The end of the level is foot. <laughs> and yes, I know, I missed I missed the treasure chest. I will I'm gonna pause the recording. Well not really pause, I'll edit it out. And then um yeah, we'll be we'll be back at that now treasure chest. Find a special yeah. hidden Momentarily for you guys, I still have to play through half the level essentially. On this gate. Alrighty, we are back at the tech gate. Here, so I'm going to open it up. His nose is so floppy. Summon him. When he's on the portal, his nose is so floppy. Like waves around as he laughs. Guide my sword. Skylanders of the tech element are so, stronger in this. You go in here. Ignoring the uh, trial for a second since I'm not trying to complete it. I saw a chest right here. I try to make my way over to the chest first, grabbing skulls along the way. Because I'm certain you won't get ten before you get to the chest. Uh, yep. You do that. That's your chest. I'm not gonna complete the level again. I'm just gonna flip to that. Show two stars. That is this level. That is this video. Because yes, it is the end of the video. I have been Skyrim Steam. This has been chapter 16. And episode 16 of our SSA walkthrough series. As always, I want you all to remember that your adventure is only just beginning.